husband Mark and I were talking about why we think Pope Francis has a strong appeal, even across people of different religious backgrounds. Among the reasons we shared, one of them was that he seems to have a common touch that communicates his genuine honouring of God's presence in the lives of ordinary people. When I think about it, that was very true of Jesus, and in doing so, he gave people a new sense of themselves and who they were. A number of things I've heard Bishop Vincent say in the time he's been with us also echo that honouring of God's presence in the real stuff of our lives. And so I'm not surprised to learn that a new priority of Parramatta Diocese is the creation of a number of people's councils across our region of Western Sydney and the mountains. I know that Mark and I are really hopeful that these soon to be formed councils will help the Bishop and help all of us who are faith leaders in various ways in communities and families to be listening for and sharing about God's call at the grassroots. As family people, we're really focused on what God's call to be church and Catholic will look like for our children as they grow up in their faith and mission. My profession as a high school teacher, as well as my personal involvement in parish ministry, keeps me interested in how the Diocese of Parramatta can best respond and grow today. How important is it that we are attuned to the stories of people of every age and background? This sense of being attuned, of really trying to listen well and being challenged to act on it, is a strong message I'm picking up from Bishop Vincent's leadership so far. I'm hearing an encouragement that we're all part of the mission, the challenge to grow and share the gift of our faith. A new initiative to support this shared mission that's about to launch is the formation of regional people's councils across our diocese. These will be known as the Deanery Councils, of which there will be five. And there will also be a main diocesan pastoral council. Like the many people who heard the good news in many languages at Pentecost, let's look forward to the sharing through many voices and lots of listening to how the Holy Spirit is speaking to us in our Diocese of Parramatta today. As the new People's Councils are about to be formed, Mark and I join with others to say happy first anniversary with us, Bishop Vincent, and thank you for your honouring of God's presence among us. Here's to the participation of all of us in the growing and sharing of faith in Western Sydney and the mountains.